Okay, so this is gonna be the NA portion. I know I'm in a little ape, you know, a little ape speed real quick on the uh, quick uh, FGO TLDR assignment. I don't know if it was too fast, too slow, but now we can take a little bit more time on NA. Well, if you guys already haven't noticed, you missed your first raid. Congratulations. Uh, you know, FGO NA is going pretty speedy. Um, date wise, yeah, it started. Farm as much as you can. It's coming in hot. If you look at the event orders, you're going to get one tonight uh, around the same time, around what, 9 p.m. my time. So yeah, it begins at 00, zero PTSTD. Now you're gonna get at 6 p.m. So farm, farm, farm to your heart's content until uh, you can't farm no more and then farm more. You're gonna be able to do all five levels. Um, Berserker, one shot to AOE is your best preference. I'm not, like, as you can clearly see. Um, the levels are pretty easy. Uh, it shouldn't be too hard. You can practically one shot during the first few phases of the event um simple stuff you like uh you know you like apocrypha go watch the anime uh, it's not bad a lot of people have different opinions on it uh it's you'll have opinions on the anime but overall it's not too shabby uh the event is completely different from the movie so don't get your shit twisted G is actually pretty good guy in this event, so don't get your flatboard chest John New simping ass, you know, all but her. I. Anywho, uh, event starts. Uh, it's going to end at March twenty third. Pretty predicted stuff. Uh, other than that, good stuff all around. It's a raid event. Have fun. Collect coins, aka points um sage chalk you know gold silver bronze mats uh you can even get a damage ce it's essentially if you can't do one shot damage well the ce is gonna help you you can bring the remember if you put any ce in the storage make sure you look through the storage so you don't forget a spaghetti a multiple raid against event the enemy will appear on the map as you progress the story fight the raid get g gun official like i've told in the first vod aoe Anti-Dragon, I think it's 30% MP, MP gain, Arts Attack, uh, Double Castoria, Loopable, pretty good stuff. Uh, and then, yeah, you got Raid Battles coming in hot. Uh, today, you missed out on this one, right? The the Jack Battle to Jack Battle. Uh, each of them drops special unique mats, so make sure you look through the guide so you don't, so you can concentrate on what mat you want to farm. Uh, just remember, you're going to, um, each of them drop different type of mats. So if you make sure you farm accordingly, so you can farm both gold, silver, bronze, and points and all that stuff accordingly. Uh, remember, uh, as well, NA does not have JP cap on QP, so you might get choked out of QP. So just be careful how you uh, sort things. Um, and then, yeah, just have fun. Uh, you will get EXP cards. Um, if you want to be very uh, pockety or AKA not stingy, but just be very conservative, uh, I recommend saving those into the storage box uh, because this anniversary, you're going to get five times EXP on CE and experience points. Uh, that will give you a really good beneficial to make tight kind of uh, CE bombs. Jikun's double EXP, so make sure you level him all the way. Trust me, he's definitely worth it if you want to go through a couple raids and couple farming methods and you want to brain dead stuff uh, a lot of people will get bomb points attack bonus all the apocrypha gang you can clearly see it here um, don't worry about it if you have them you do if you don't you don't you can check it out on the event buff right uh, so don't get too uh triggered um the reason why kintoki was uh is here is because kintoki is low-key was supposed to be an apocrypha but he was pulled out due to the fact that um he would have been too good as a both pro and a friend story-wise and gameplay-wise uh therefore he is excluded uh that went with i believe uh yeah benki uh, gregorius and the others uh they were kind of like a cast outs uh, due to um, due to final preparation and whatnot, but anywho, let us move on. Uh, yeah, you can get the attack up from the uh, add fairs to equipment. Uh, uh, Dracul coins you can get in an afternoon. So the Jeek Gun, 
uh yeah siegfried and uh your boy right there is coins mordred and the man is going to be damage john new is gold amakusa is silver astelfo kin is bronze get what you need final ascension if you already have g congratulations free rare prisms uh rare prisms out the wazoo good stuff uh yeah the ce is not too shabby it's not the craziest it's not the worst it's not the best but i highly recommend you collect them uh this time uh, congratulations if you like mordred uh jp can give you a glass mordred uh now na can actually get the uh, memories of tarifas aka the uh short super cut mordred clothing which is pretty cool i like them you need bones um uh wings uh dragon fangs and blood tears and qp to get it it's awesome you can now get it get it while you can uh this is the part where mordred gets her cigarette buff aka cigarette line uh, which makes her get buster star concentration more crit damage a large amount of c uh large amount of stars which is nice also this will give um vlad an upgrade two here uh applies guts one turn that can be stackable um and an increase mp gain for three turns uh for you which is great uh makes him better and better uh and then yeah amaksa gets his prayer for the long journey change the ce star three turn increase mp gain for one ally are you gonna have your apocrypha rate up i'm not gonna talk about too much about it. if you want to roll for it go for it if you want any of these characters low key now is the time for you to roll uh but remember you already know what's happening uh raid wise like i've already told you before you're going to have to be a little spicy uh with the events uh, it's not gonna wait up for you it's gonna be like jp uh, a lot of people will be farming this event so just kind of keep your eyes on it uh game update wise you got all your good stuff uh, event craft essence wise you can already see it here farming guide boom uh if you're willing to farm uh just pure mats uh these are your best places you're not gonna get them now uh, of course because those these are the last minute i highly recommend though highly recommend do the entire um uh, yeah intermediate advanced expert all that good stuff uh, due to the fact that it'll give you free apples right it'll give you a 10 ap to uh half of your ap so if you're at 140 you get 70 ap which is pretty worth it uh, and then, like I said, you can do like one silver apple and do like three bronze and still be worth it. Three bronze to silver apple, blah, blah, blah. All that good stuff. You will get a lot, a lot of opportunities to collect bronze and silver. So take this opportunity to do um, efficient, efficient farming, right? So you do bronze, collect bronze to do silver, silver to gold, da, 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 da. Uh, it's worth it. Trust me. If you're and you can use the extra AP that you accumulate onto the raid, right? Uh yeah, it gets you gold apples. It's it's really nice. That's why I'm telling you that I recommend it. Farm it, do it. You can't go wrong. Uh, other than that, main quest, point ladders. You're going to get about I think two, two lores. Yeah, I think it was two to three lores. I can't remember. It should be two. Uh, so just farm it to your heart's content. It's not that hard. Uh, your friends should have mats. Um, a lot of people are going to just try to cheese it. Like, brrr, it's not bad. It's not crazy. Um, just look at the mats, right? That's all I can really tell you. Look at the mats that what you want and farm to your, uh, at your pace, at your convenience. This is specifically just NA. So I'm only talking about NA. So thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you click that like button, share, subscribe for that TLDR NA style. And I'll see you guys in the next VOD. Bye.